Welcome to Review Time with Tim. Today, I am doing a pickle review, specifically from the Dollar Tree. We have the Von Holten's Regular Pickle. And, of course, we have the Hot Pickle. As always, subscribe to my channel, smash likes, comments, notification bells, and let's get into today's pickle review what? all right so we have the von holton's dill pickle from the dollar tree uh, it says, no need for refrigeration, made in America, um, and it's a hearty dill flavor. Pickle seems fairly good size. This was $1 because it was from the, in the Dollar Tree. Uh, we have fat-free, low calories, low carbs, gluten-free. And we're coming in at about... Well, we're coming in with sodium today, about 16% of your daily value, 370 milligrams, uh, about five servings per container, which is weird. So this whole package is not one serving, uh, so be mindful of that, but it is zero calories, but this whole pickle is not considered one serving, it's considered five servings. So that right there, you know, that's a lot of sodium. And then, of course, we have here the uh, the hot one. Okay, same thing. Made in America. Dollar Tree special here. Uh, it's fat-free, low-calorie, low-sodium. It's gluten-free. And uh, the sodium in this one is 410 milligrams of sodium in this one. So it's trumping the other one. Uh, and again, five servings per this container. So this pickle is freaking feed. It's a lot of, a lot of serving for, for one person. All right, so uh, because it's in a pouch and there's all that liquid is in there uh, and it's, it's filled right up there. I mean, the liquid's right up there. It does have a little like tear away here, but uh, I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use some scissors today so I don't get uh, uh, so, so we don't get pickle juice everywhere. All right. Oh, and uh, for the packaging today. I thought the packaging was pretty cute with the pickle, and it's got like the little like pickle juice squirting everywhere. Uh, so we're gonna hit the packaging score with a six on the blue, and uh, we're gonna go with the, also a six on the spicy. So we got double sixes here today. All right, next up, I'm doing the uh, dill smell test. can definitely smell like that salty brine solution that the dill is in. Very, uh, it's, a, it's a lighter smell though. It's not like if you open up a can of Velasix or anything like that. It's not, it's not that strong of a smell, so it's definitely a lighter dill smell, but it's pleasant. So I'm going to also hit this one with a six as well for the smell. Let's crack open the hot, the hot pickle. Right. Let's take a little sniff of the hot pickle. Ooh. It smells more sweet than the other one. It has a kind of a weird odor or weird smell. Definitely reminds me of like um, like uh, the sweet pickles. And I'm not really liking the smell too much. Yeah, it's definitely more of a sweet smell with that salty brine solution that the pickle is in. Uh, I'm gonna go for this one for a smell. I'm gonna go with a four. All right, next up we're gonna do a taste test on the blue one right here. Get in there with a the fork. Oh, 
Oh man, that is a big pickle. I will give it that. Oh man, oh man. I mean, for a dollar, that's not too bad. I and mean, that's a good size pickle for one buck. Alright, let's see what the taste is. Mm. I don't know. I'm gonna take one more bite. This is juicy. I am not really, I'm not really digging the flavor of this pickle. I will give it that it is quite crunchy. It does have a good bite to it when you bite into it. But this flavor, the, the salty mix and whatever the, the solution is that they mix in here to pickle this one. Now, I'm not liking that. Uh, so I'm going to give this a three on the taste test for the blue one. This one's getting a three. Mm. All right, let's move on. And let's try out the spicy one, shall we? Hot and spicy, the hot one. All right, so we had a three. This one smelled good. That blue one smelled good. Now, this is the one that I didn't really care for the smell. So we'll see what this, this is going to come out to be. Same thing, a nice, really nice, whoa, really nice big pickle. Again, a dollar from the Dollar Tree. This is the hot one. All right, here we go. Woo. This one's definitely got more punch to it than the other one. Definitely adds some hotness to it, for sure. But it's got the same flavor almost as the other one, but with just more heat, which the heat that kind of makes it taste a little better. Super juicy pickle. It is super juicy. <clears throat> Slightly better. Heat's not too bad. A little bit on the rim of my mouth. A little bit of the heat on my tongue. Uh, but then it goes away pretty quickly. Definitely has a slight better taste than the blue packaging one. So I'm going to go with a 5 for the taste on the hot one today. No, I don't like that. Slightly better taste than the blue packaging one. So I'm going to hit this hot one with a four okay just a little bit better than the blue one but i'm really not digging the the flavor profile of whatever they whatever they marinate this pickle in but the hot one's definitely better for sure all right let's tally it all up and let's get today's overall score all right so for the numbers the blue regular dill style type pickle we're coming in at 15 out of 30 so it did make the halfway point but the taste ah i just was not loving that taste but the smell the, it smelled way better than it tasted and of course i did like the packaging and of course we have the hot one and it tasted better than the other one but it didn't really have much of a smell and again i did like the packaging uh, and this one came in at 14 out of 30 total possible points for today. And again, I picked these up at the Dollar Tree. So for $1, you really can't go too wrong. Uh, if you've ever had these, let me know. Comment down below. I want to hear your thoughts and opinions on these two pickles. As always, subscribe to my channel. Smash the likes, comments below, and I will... Uh, Check you all later.